the village wakes up every morning with chirping of birds and a busy day begins but the day at hornbill cottage starts differently the owner of the house gulapi chettia remains busy feeding a group of oriental pied hornbills every morning the hornbills come to her and demand breakfast sitting on the tree in front of the hornbill cottage she keeps ready numerous fruits for the hornbills prakriti amulya hampad we all should work for conservation of biodiversity the hornbills come to our place we provide banana guava papaya etc fruits every day it is a story of a village named borbhui chettia gaon which is situated under dhimichi gaon panchayat in dibrugarh district of assam In 2015 an organization named Assam Bandhu started awareness campaign for conservation of hornbills in the area The organization conducted signature campaign among the people It carried out postering in numerous places Some awareness meetings were also conducted in the village so that a favorable atmosphere was created for the birds noted literator human borgohai took part in such an awareness meet the movement to save nature has been getting much importance in present time he planted a sapling to encourage the people in the village I shall not cut the tree where hornbills are making nest every year I shall prevent others from cutting it too because hornbills are rare birds we are trying to provide favorable atmosphere for their breeding since that time the number of hornbills has been increasing rapidly The organization selected Gulapi Chetia, an ardent lover of birds, to carry on the activities in the village. Gulapi Chetia is the retired headmistress of the number no. two Majumelia LP School. After her retirement. She is devoting her time to promote the conservation work in the locality. She lives a life amidst nature. The lonely lady does everything by herself. but her concern towards the birds gets the utmost priority she has planted some 200 banana trees in her compound so that hornbills can get ripe banana throughout the year the hornbills pair for life once an army man from the village killed a male bird of a pair some 40 years back but that person too got killed in a train blast while returning to his workplace after the vacation the female bird cried in utter disappointment making heartbreaking sounds for several years in the village as the monsoon starts the hornbills prepare nests for breeding amar marsor 15 tarikh pore mane sorai hale baas we notice 
that birds were preparing for nesting from March 15th. The female bird entered the nest on April 1st. We think that the female bird is hatching the eggs now. The male hornbill is supplying fruits for her. Villagers offer banana on the tree so that the male hornbill does not require to go too far to collect food. The development of the country is not possible without the growth of tourism industry. To attract tourists, we have to save our flora and fauna. We have to keep our Assam beautiful with all the plants, birds and animals. Everybody should work to keep Assam evergreen. Tourists have been visiting our village during this season. We are expecting some more in future. The village won the prestigious Homen Borgohai Green Award 2016 for hornbill conservation. We are glad to receive the Human Borgohai Green Award. Villagers got inspiration to work more and more. Sometimes, people of the village offer traditional treatment to the sick hornbills which fall down from the trees. Due course of time, does come round. Keeping an eye to the scarcity of suitable trees for making nests by the hornbills, an experiment is being carried on by Assam Bandhu now. It has installed an artificial nest on a tree. Now, the members of the organization are waiting eagerly to see till the breeding season of the hornbills whether the birds will select it for nesting or not. In modern times, the habitats of wild animals and birds have been shrinking gradually. The harmonious coexistence between man and hornbills in the village is indeed a rare example.